What is up everybody? It is your boy Nicholas Bagels here and I am back hey, with another YouTube video. Okay, so this video I am going to be giving y'all my opinions on each zodiac sign. Okay. Now, disclaimer, this is my opinions okay for y'all that's gonna get offended yeah this is my opinion this is how I feel about you yo sign um we're gonna start off um with Aquarius um Aquarius they are easy to love but even harder to hate. I don't think I said that right. That's the reason I took a pause. Yeah, they're easy to love and build a genuine connection with. Yeah, but it's it's hard to really hate them because you the love that you have for them is so strong. And I'm speaking in particular because of course, y'all know I used to have an Aquarius best friend. And not spreading too much light on like our situation that made us fall out. But in all honesty, being real, I still care about her to this day. I still be having my moments when I want to reach out, check up on her, make sure she's good. But after some of the foul stuff that has transpired between us I'm, I'm I I just gotta keep pushing gotta keep my life going I've also learned that they they kinda not right in the head Aquarius they're like almost mentally unstable they love arguing about everything up under the sun they will pick an argument with you for no reason and I don't know why that is. They argumentative. Argumentative. I said argumentative. They're argumentative. <laughs> They're very argumentative. It can be annoying at times. I'm trying to think of something good. I guess you can have a great time with an Aquarius. Although they don't be seeming like the party type. But they can. If they really vibe with you. And really kick it with you. Then yeah. Y'all can have a great time together. Um, We moving right along. Um, we gonna do. Pisces. <laughs> Um, Pisces, they're amazing, great time, fun to be around, amazing energy, they lack too much. Every other word is almost a lie. That's how much Pisces lie. I, I can't do it. I'm sorry. I can't do it. They just lie so much. They just lie so much. Um, I was going to say something else about a Pisces. But that was just about one Pisces in particular. I kind of talked to a Pisces. Oh my God. I shouldn't have said that. Because people probably going to know who I'm talking about now. Um... But I guess Pisces also have a problem with 
being emotional, really showing their feelings. At least that's how a Pisces once was with me. <laughs> Dated, talk to, whatever you want to categorize it, okay? That's how that was with me. Um, I don't really got too, too much to say about a Pisces. I'm trying to think of the signs and go on order. Okay, next, we have an Aries. Controlling. <laughs> Controlling. Delusional. <laughs> Crazy. I have a friend that dates a Aries. When I say delusional ain't even a word. Calls a hundred times in one minute. Don't even think that's humanly possible. Obsessive. I was going to say that uh, Aries They play games This is from my personal experience They play games I'm going to leave that right though Next we got a uh, Taurus I think I said that right But a uh, uh, Taurus They're born they don't sugarcoat nothing. Straight to the point. I'm saying this because I worked with one before. And I had a couple of childhood friends that were Tauruses. I think I'm saying that right. I never dated a Taurus, so I can't get my personal. That's all I can say about a Taurus. What's next? A Gemini? Gemini. They are amazing. I love me some Geminis. They're they're blunt too. They don't sugarcoat anything. Great to be around. Great to have fun with. Include playing games. So that's another thing I would say about the Gemini. They be on they be on BS. Yeah, they be on BS. It's so crazy because I was reading an assumption and they said that Gemini's are fake. <laughs> um I don't I haven't had any dealings with a fake Gemini, so I, don't, I can't really attest to that. So that's all I got to say about Gemini's. Cancers. Mm, Crybaby Cancers is what we going to call them, okay? Because they do be crying, oh my god. Um, great to be around, funny, they're supportive, some hoes. That's all I'm gonna say, and I'm gonna leave it at that. Um, Leos, they are fun to hang with. They are some freaking liars. The one Leo friend that I got that I've been friends with for like. Over like four years, they're also persistent. Like they gonna go after what they want, and they gonna keep going after and keep chasing you down. They're very persistent. At least the one that I got is very persistent to the point that it's annoying. So I say that too. They're annoying. <laughs> Their persistency is annoying. I don't even think persistency is a word, but it. Their consistency is annoying, okay? That's all I'm going to say about them. It's that end. I don't got too much more to say about them. Um, what's next? Virgos.
they play victim so much and they can't take accountability for their actions also they think that they can do nothing wrong also they're selfish I feel like they only think about themselves I'm gonna leave that right there I'm going to leave it right there. Next. Libras. <laughs> We're amazing. <laughs> Look at me being biased. Okay. Let me stop. Because I'm a Libra. Let me stop. But Libras, they're amazing. Great to be around. They are mean, blunt, whatever you want to categorize it as. They're very, like, chill, calm. Just don't get on their bad side. But it's some leavers out here that are manipulative. Thank you, God. I ain't got that trait. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Because, mm-mm. That, I'm going to leave that right there. Next, Scorpios. They are loyal. They are amazing. Talkative. Um... I can't think of much about Scorpios. That is crazy. Mean. I'm going to leave that right there. I don't really got too much to say about Scorpios. Um, next, Sagittarius. Self centered. Mm. I guess you would say hard workers. I don't really got too much to say about them. Yeah, last one, Capricorns. Some hoes. <laughs> With the H, the O, and the E, and hoes. And I guess you can say that they're. Presence is like welcoming. That's all I can think of about them. If y'all already know, it's, it's because my TV is on. And yeah, I'm going to leave this video at that. Comment whatever y'all want to comment in the comments. Make sure you like this video. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you follow my social medias. That is in the intro and the outro of this video. And it will be in the description down below. Make sure you stream my music. Everywhere music is sold. New music coming soon. Um, I'm cooking up, cooking up something. Um, yeah, I put like two sneak peeks on to my new Instagram so yeah go over to my new Instagram and check that out I think I'm going to do a video of me reading assumptions of zodiac signs that I find online fun fact I actually did do that video I started recording that video like a couple of days ago um, I had the screenshots and everything completed the video actually all I was supposed to do was just upload the um, screen recordings to the video but I was being lazy thank y'all so much for watching make sure y'all like comment and subscribe and yeah y'all will see me real real soon ah, with more videos to come and that song uh,
Thank you.